the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, the Spinners. Yep, greatest uh, hits of rock and roll of the whole generation are all back on one radio station and here to tell us all about. This new oldie station is the president and CEO of Kindred Communication. We're talking about Mike Kurtner. Um, yeah, people have heard welcome. you on the air. You used to play these songs when they That's first came right. out. I just happened to do that. You're <laughs> back in the day, Tim. Yeah. Uh -huh. yes. in, in fact, there was a lot of us that did this back a long time ago. Is this That's you? you. That is me. Okay, That's you. I hope our camera can zoom oh, yeah. in on this. Yeah, I love this right picture, now. Mike. There you go. There it is. That's a great picture. That's you and the rest of the gang and... You haven't changed a bit? No, no really? not at all. A little less hair. I mean, <laughs> a little less hair, a little hair, but that's, the, and that's kind of the idea here is yeah. that, like, uh, this generation, and, uh, you know, the Rolling Stones just came out with a new album, and I'm telling they you, I bought it, I bought it on vinyl. out there, yeah. It's, they are still, I, I can't believe that Mick uh -huh. Jagger can still sing like that. Yeah. No, the, the, the Rolling Stones had the number one album. Yeah. The Beatles had the number one single. Yeah. And Cher had the number one Christmas album yeah. all this year. Right. I know. This hasn't gone anywhere. Right? Yeah. It, it really has. So, so there's such a, a thirst and a hunger for that yeah. kind of music, um, because I think it is, you know, nostalgia always makes us feel good about the past. That's why it's nostalgic. Where we were. Where were you with all of this? Oh my gosh. I remember starting. <laughs> I just remember that was growing my, up hearing these tunes. Yeah, same with me. I was. I had older brothers and sisters, mm -hmm. and so and they grew up with that vinyl, the original vinyl. Uh -huh. And so it was kind of given to me, and I was I listened to it as a child growing up. To I listened to at the, that time we called them the oldies. Yeah. They were you know, 10, 15 years old by yeah. then. And now, now this stuff's like 50, 60 years old. 60 years old and still uh -huh. very, very current. Still in movies. In fact, yeah. I'll sh share this with you too. There used to be TV shows that came in here from where the action is. Uh -huh. And these were the old Dick Clark shows oh, that came wow. in back in the day. Paul Revere and the Raiders. Wow. Uh, you know, Neil Diamond toured on this show back at that time. Uh -huh. And the funny part of it is, for some reason, somebody decided that the music for somebody that was over 50 years of age uh -huh wasn't relevant anymore. Yeah. I think it is, and based on the response we're getting on the radio station, it yeah. definitely is. Even I've never more. seen anything like this. Yeah, yeah, I would think so. So, the, yeah, and the viewer, or viewers and listeners, uh, viewers of these, like these videos on YouTube, when you look at the videos mm -hmm. of yeah. some of these oldie songs on there, they're well into the millions. So clearly there's an audience there, Yeah. and you're finding that out you know, on the radio station level as well. Tim, the, the, when we started doing this, this was last August, and the funny, we go on an oldies cruise every year, they call it the Flower Power. Oh, cruise, which fun. I want to make a presentation to you. It's Ooh. only fitting that we do a flower power shirt <laughs> oh, I uh, love for this. Tim and Susan. So oh there's my that gosh, for look you. At that. And this is Tim. one size fits most. You can't have a radio okay. station unless you get a free t shirt. You guys oh, do umbrellas, yeah. we do t shirts. I love this. So, there you wow. go. Oh, that's so cute. But we, we do we do a flower power cruise every year, and uh -huh. it's a very it's, it's, uh, it's, it that's sells funny. out in a day and a half. I'm sure it does. Yeah, and it's amazing. Mm -hmm. And there's over 2,000 people on the ship, and I thought, well, these people have the financial resources to do whatever they want to do, but we don't promote to them anymore. Right. Yeah. So we just gave them back what they wanted. And the other irony, ironic part of this is uh. the cow seals. If you remember them, they yeah. inspired the Partridge family. Mm -hmm. Well, I've gotten to know them, mm -hmm. and we're getting ready to do a syndicated radio show that will originate here that will go nationwide wow. with the cow seals. Oh, my. And you've gotten it's to know them fun. and talked oh to them. Oh, my goodness. And, uh, yeah. How about that? And I think it's great that you actually, for <laughs> this picture, now, you have to pay residuals to Keith Morehouse for using <laughs> from the so. early 70s right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that definitely looks like him. He's got an afro, though. So yeah, Keith's hair was a little different. So, um. yeah. and, but he had the mustache, he had the fro, he had everything going. But he was, that you know, and it's, as, as we all get older, we love this kind of music, and that's what's fun. Even if you, you can like modern music, you, right. can, you can like anything that's out there, and still, this stuff just has a certain appeal to it. It doesn't, yeah. get, it doesn't age, really. It doesn't age. And, and isn't that amazing? I, it is to me. I, I've got I, a, an extensive record collection, as oh do you. Oh, my goodness, yeah. yes. Uh, and, and I treat them like children. I just enjoy being around it. In fact, I've told many, many people that I would never have met you or anyone else uh, without the music, yeah. and probably eighty percent of the people I've met is because it I does love bring music. people together. Wow. Real quickly before we wrap up, if folks you know watching right now they think, well, I would like to request mm -hmm. some of my favorite oldies. How do they do that? Is it like the old days? You just you call, can call in, oh, call, you can call the radio that. station or text, and uh -huh. we'll take good care of you. There and you that's go. the other thing too. Just like you guys, we're here, uh -huh. and and, uh, and they'll take good care of everybody. Keep uh -huh. calling and keep calm and request a song. I like the way that sounds. <laughs> that that's great. That is wonderful. Well, Mike, thanks so much. For
for coming in well, and talking about this. And thanks for the great I gifts. Know, I, we love this. I want to see really cool. one of these days. I know. Absolutely. Yeah. Stop, <laughs> stop by any time because we love talking about the oldies music. We even yeah. both started out in radio back in the day. Right. So. Yep. Yeah. It's, um, but some of us just have faces for radio, so we say where we were. <laughs> Mike. I understand. <laughs> great talking with you. Yeah, I'm still fooling them, Mike. Thanks. <laughs>